This one. Come on. Jesus' name. the lady? Who knows the lady? No one. Lift her up. Come here and touch you again. Jesus name. Come on. Come on. Out. Lift her again for the last time. Sister, I'm removing the spiritual husband on you. Amen. You hear me? Amen. The spirit is making you to suffer. Come out, you demon! Uh. Out, you spiritual husband! Come out! There's a lady here. Mama, you. Can I pray for you? Look here, I want to pray for you. You hear me? Yes. I want to pray for you. Yes. You know, I, I saw what you're going through. Amen. And I believe God will open doors for you. Amen. You hear me? Amen. But when I look at you, I, I went to this place called Delmas. Yes. When I reached there, I saw a lady yeah. that has got two children. It's so like now there's another child now, but I saw it. you people, you were friends, very close. Okay. You hear me? Yes. Very close. You know, yes. I'm, I'm hearing a name called Maria. Yes. Huh? Yes. You know Maria? I know her. When was the last time you spoke with her? I think last year, December. Last year. You yes. people, you used to be very close, isn't it? Yeah, very huh? close. Very, yes. very, very close. Yes. You know, as I'm praying for you, even Maria will be free. Amen. You hear me? Amen. Huh? Amen. In Jesus' name. Jesus, my name. It's like you're working now. Huh? Huh? Yes, there's mm. some other time. You're not a happy though. No. Come here. I'm praying for her, even Maria will be free. Because they used to be friends, very close friends. Huh? The lady of. Yeah. It's like she's a bit fat. Yes. <laughs> the name of Jesus. Come on. Come on. Come on, you demon. Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ, viewers all over the world. Welcome to Cheris Missionary Church. This is our Sunday live service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T.E. Magananesa. And with me here today is my sister, who is located during the service by Prophet Andres Sumano, who minister upon her life. Ma'am, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Hi, my name is Nancy Munyai. I'm coming from Pretoria East. Prophet Andres located you and he spoke to you. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Okay, he was telling me about my sister. I call her my sister. Her name is Maria. She was so close to me. I was treated as a sister, not as a friend. <laughs> it just reminded me that there was a friend that was very close to you. Her name is Maria. Uh, now she's having three kids, but on that time she was having two, which is true. Mm -hmm. Then uh, it's been long, me and Maria were not talking. Or the other day, I think it was around December, she just greet me on my phone and say hi, sister, I say hi, that's all. And we were very close. She was like a sister to me because when I'm working, I was the one who was taking care of her, even her family. Ah. How do you feel that Prophet Andres located you and ministered upon your life and even declared that as he's praying for your situation, he's also setting Maria free? Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm very much happy, even for her, because she means a lot to me. 
she's a sister and she was loving God and we were separated for a very long time. Then today I saw the grace of God and when Prophet locate me, I was so happy when he's telling me about my sister because she one of the best. Uh, she's so kind and she loved God so much. But it's been long that I was not around her. But I thank God because today when God was reminding me, he reminded her too. Amen. Amen. I want to pray for you. Your time to cry is over. Amen. Thank you, man. Of you God. hear me? Amen. You have been disappointed is enough. Amen. I'm praying for you. This year, something must happen. Amen. In Jesus' name. You need to pray. You hear me? Yes. You need to pray yes. for your kidneys. Yes. You hear me? Yes. You know, I see it's like very soon they are going to check you. You hear me? Yes. And you have seen some signs. I believe Jesus will heal you. Yes, and I've been to the hospital. Yes. Yes. You have been to the hospital? Yes. Like when was that? It's a three, I can say it's last month. Twice. Yes. I've been hospitalized twice. You've been night. hospitalized twice. Yes. Let's give glory to Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Uh, do God. you believe Jesus is healing you today? Sorry? Do you believe Jesus is healing you? Yes, I believe. You, you, you're not going to go to hospital. I believe this healing will be permanent. Thank you, Lord. You hear me? I hear you. In Jesus' name. <laughs> Jesus' name. see a very old man say, oh, the power of God does not play. Eh? You, you ask yourself, what is happening to him? Eh? And uh, people are saying, we are buying you. So you see people doing like this. You know, they, they are buying them. No, I don't know him. I don't know this man. I'm just stretching my hand like this. He say, oh, Oh, you know him. Look at this man. When I go close, <laughs> can, can you hear that? Put your mic, brother. Put your mic. Is the mic working? Please, let's get a mic that is. Can you hear that? In the name of Jesus. Be healed now. Yes. Now. Now. Yes. Now. Yes. Now in the name of Jesus. Be healed. <laughs> yes, three. You hear me? But it looks like the issue of papers is to destroy this marriage. Do you hear me? Yes, prophet. So now we need God to intervene. Yes, prophet. And what is the will of God about this? Because there must be a will of God. Do you hear me? Yes, prophet. So as I'm praying for you, if the issue of papers is the end of the marriage, let it be so. If it's from God. But if it's meant to be, after this, there will be a solution. Yes, prophet. You are hearing me? Yes, prophet. Because sometimes we fight spirits. Fight spirits that are not visible. <clears throat> so now I want to pray for you. I'm not going to help you. Jesus will help you. Yes, prophet. Do you hear me?
She's free. Come here. Allow me to relax because I'm not going to take time. Jesus name. You're free. Bring this brother again. <laughs> brother, you need to pray for your job. Yes, prophet. You hear me? Yes, I hear you. I see challenges. And very serious challenges. Yes, prophet. And I don't want you to go to court. You hear me? Yes, prophet. I believe God will fight for you. Thank you. I just see a problem that is coming. In Jesus' name. And because lately you have been also having problem of the headache. Yes, prophet. Now, hitting you on both sides. In Jesus' name. Free. Please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Uh, my name is Maanda. I come from uh, Limpopo, but I reside in uh, Auckland Park. Prophet Andres located you and ministered upon your life. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Uh, he said I, uh, I do have a headache uh, sometimes. And then he also mentioned the issue of my, my job uh, to say that they don't want me to, to go to court because there are issues uh, at work that are uh, coming yes and so how do you feel that prefer and dislocated you and minister upon your life regarding something that the devil is planning to do uh, i feel uh, re uh, relieved uh, because i'm sure uh, if I, I i didn't know uh, maybe i don't know what was going to happen Where is your brother? In Tembisa. Jesus. He must pray. Do you hear me? Yes. I see some people that are close to him. They must not push him towards alcohol. Okay. Okay. Do you hear me? Yes, man of God. Because these are people who love soccer. Yes, you know, yes. They, they love soccer a lot, but I see, I'm also hearing there's a brother called Emmanuel. Yes, his friend. Yes. 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 I, I'm hearing this brother called Emmanuel. These are soccer people. Yes, yes. No? Yes, that's mm. true. So now, please, they must not push him towards alcohol. He must resist. He must win them to Christ. Yes. Yes, thank you. I'm sure you're hearing me. Yes, man of God. Yes. Jesus will help you. Yes. As I'm praying for you. Oh. Jesus mighty name. You're free. Kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Leonard Voma. I'm from Springs. Prophet Andres located you and he minister upon your life. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Uh, Prophet really picked, located me and he picked me among the congregants and I found out that what he was prophesying was true about my brother who had some friends, wrong friends, who pushed him to the wrong direction. He was going through, you know when you are becoming successful, there are people who come in your life and direct you, you thought that they are friends but they are directing him in the wrong way. So I know this, I've been seeing this, but today I thank God that he has seen it, he has seen this, and my brother, as the prophet was praying for me, I believe that my brother is free from this friend.